Hey, what's up you guys? It's Ruthie and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're going to go into chapter 84 of The Murder House by James Patterson and David Ellis. So let's get right into this video. This video may contain sensitive topics and foul language. If you do not wish to continue, I suggest you click off the video now. You have been warned. Chapter 84. The East Hampton Town Police responded to Justin's call. I know some members of the force from working on the multiple jurisdictional drug task force, but I don't know any of the ones who arrive at the scene. It's clear the officers know who I am when I give them my name thanks to the Noble Walker trial. They are respectful and courteous as they scribble their notes and take photographs and scan the living room and backyard for evidence. I sit quietly for hours letting them do their work, waiting for one of them to inform me that there's an a warrant outstanding for my arrest or an APB from the STPD, but it doesn't happen. No handcuffs come out, no perk walk. They just promise to keep us updated on the investigation and leave. An armed invasion in East Hampton is something that cops take seriously, so I know they're going to be looking hard for Aiden now. Which also means that if Aiden has a single functioning brain cell in his head, he's in the wind now, gone, skedaddled. I'm sorry about this, I say to Justin. He was after me, not you. I brought him to your house. He brought himself. Justin touches my arm. You're the good guy, remember? Not sure about that. I'd say Justin's the good guy, and damn it, I really wish my feelings for him went deeper than that. I wish I could manufacture some chemistry, a spark between us. The wind whips us straining the large pieces of cardboard that we used to cover the shattered window i have to go i say stay it's after four in the morning and you can't go home i probably can go home actually apparently isaac's plan to take care of me doesn't include issuing a warrant for my arrest for breaking into aiden's house so yeah i can probably go home but i won't not yet aiden's surely not home after all what better time to visit his house again that is the end of this chapter i will see you guys in the next video bye